Hey everyone, I'm back out here on the Sonoma Coast. It's a Friday afternoon. I got one crab ring with me, um, type B, the conical type. Um, so we're gonna see what we can do. Hopefully we can find some link cod and some bottom fish and uh, we'll see how we can start this trip off. Started out in 68 feet of water. Normally the lean cod are in the shallows this time of the year. So let's see what happens. So I'm um, starting off with a uh, three ounce monster head that I, uh, I powder coated it red, put some eyes on it, and I got a monster swim bait on there. So that's what we're starting off with, with uh, one of the little glow in the dark rubber squids. And I got it on my Daiwa Walmart special rod and reel combo. Um, I did have to put the pin reel on it um, just because I broke the handle last go around. There's a decent one. Let's see what we got here, guys. It ain't gigantic, but it's decent. Got herself a nice china. Not a bad way to start off. We'll keep it. That's a good one. That's what we're looking for. I always hook up on good stuff when I'm not ready. I think it's an undersizer, but we'll check them out. Yeah, that one's a little small. We're gonna let that one go. First lean cod of the afternoon though. Good times. All right, we're gonna go check the crab pot real quick. See how we do here, guys. First pull, homemade. Conical pot. It felt heavy for a second, but now it don't. Found the urchins. 
So it tells me we're not where we want to be. Got something that just feels really heavy. It's not fighting. It's just heavy. Now it's fighting. The lingcod. It's a baby lingcod, but it's a lingcod. Here we go, guys. Lingcod number two. Letting it go. Gotta try something different. Let's try this other rod. I like these uh, little sand eels. I think they're made by Daiwa. Could be wrong. Oh, look at that. It's all spun up. That wasn't helping me. Nice little gopher, drop him back. There's a decent something. Probably another link hide. We'll see if this one's big enough though. I think this one might be big enough. I think that this one's gonna make it. Oh yeah, this one makes it. That's a good lean guy. <laughs> Like that. There we go. Keeper ling number one. That's a good ling cod, probably 28 inches. Not bad. Throw it on the stringer. Well, we're still marking, so I'm gonna drop it back down. See if we can get another one, you guys. There's another ling or something with some decent size. Let's see what we got. This one's fighting though. Not as big as the last one, you guys, but it's definitely decent. It's a nice thing. Oh. I think it might be bigger than the first one. To be honest. Or it's at least twins. This one's 26. There we go. Keeper ling number two, 26 incher. Sonoma Coast. I do like using my line counter reel for bottom fishing. It's kind of nice. You know how deep you are. 
when you're dropping. Like it says I'm in 61 feet of water and it normally takes about 70 feet. Yep, 72 feet. And I'm on the bottom. And then when you're reeling your fish up, you know it's 10 feet up underneath you. So guys, this is just a cheap Abu Garcia that uh, I think I paid 50 bucks at the pro shop for it. I don't know if they still make them, but it's an Abu Garcia line counter. And I just got it on an old Fenwick rod. Not nothing fancy. Um, a lot like an ugly stick uh, in like the 12 to 30 pound glass. It's got another link. Hope not. Oh, this one's fighting. That might not be a link. Let's see. Oh, another link guy. Another keeper lane, guys. Another keeper. Whee! Look at this. I don't know if you guys can see it, but these things are cool. Look at that keeper, guys. There we go. Keeper Ling Cod number three. Number five for the day. Overboard it goes. See you later, buddy. Go make some babies. So what I'm doing is I got a, I got some sardine chunks here. And I'm putting a chunk of sardine on that back one. When I drop it over like to find some verms. I haven't caught one of those yet today. Oh, there's something good. Oh. Probably another link eye, guys. We'll let it go. They're a whole lot of fun to catch. Yep. Oh no. That's a cap. We can keep that one. They got to be 15 inches. We'll check them here real quick. Pretty sure he's 15 with a little bit to spare. Yep. He is 17 and a half. A little 17 and a half inch cap. Oh, there we go. We got something big on there. Is this gonna be our 40 inch link cut? I hope it's a 10 pound berm. Or a 20 pound cap. Well, maybe not a 20, a 10. I'd love to catch another cap. No, oh, another keeper lane. There we go. Keeper Ling number four. Let's go. Star and R. You're free to go. There you go.
nothing. Oh, there's a gopher in here. Let's let the gopher go. All right, guys, look at that hole. Sonoma Coast, got eight bottom fish this afternoon. Got my lean cod, let other keepers go. Let some unders go. Good time. Gotta get into the beach though. I hope you guys liked the video. Thank you for watching. Please like, please subscribe, share with all your friends, and tight lines until next time. Limit the lean cod on a Friday afternoon. <laughs>